This is 88, 90, and 98 is over there. Yeah, this is 84 and 86, but 94 should be over there, and it's not. Alejandra, Carolina en Francisco stonden nogal raar te kijken toen ze afgelopen week hun taxi uitstapten in de Kanaalstraat. Op nummer 94 had hun Airbnb-adres moeten zitten, maar het nummer bestaat niet. Wat was je eerste thought? Uh, well, we thought we might be wrong, like we might have the address wrong or maybe we weren't looking right, but the neighbors came out and they all said they didn't know where it was. De foto's op de site zagen er goed uit. De recensies waren goed, er leek niks aan de hand. There was no way for us to know that it was a fake apartment. De buren schieten te hulp en bellen met de host, ene Natasha uit Londen. And she said that the apartment had been flooded and that she had cancelled it to Airbnb. But that Airbnb had not informed us. That's not true. Do you think he, she did it on purpose? I believe so. Because she answered on the phone to the neighbor. And she uh, persisted on, on the lie. Ook wij probeerden Natasha vandaag meerdere malen te bereiken. Sorry, but the person you've called isn't available at the moment. Helaas nam zij niet op. What do you want to say to the to the host if she is watching? <laughs> oh, she shouldn't have done that. Yes. Uh, that. She was kind of having fun, I think. And that's that's wrong. Airbnb laat aan AT5 weten de situatie te betreuren en heeft het geld terugbetaald aan de familie. Ze zeggen contact op te nemen met de host om te onderzoeken wat er is misgegaan. Gelukkig was er voor de pechvogels nog een ander Airbnb-adres beschikbaar voor de rest van hun tijd in Amsterdam. Uh, everyone as well was really nice. We really liked the city.